Hey guys, Design Ninja here today. I'm going to show you how to open an Adobe Illustrator CC file format in Adobe Illustrator CS6 or older versions. Right now I have this EPS file that was created in Creative Cloud, but I'm on CS6. Okay, let's go ahead and try to open the file. You're going to get this dialog box that says, can't open the illustration. The file was generated by a newer version of Illustrator and cannot be opened. Alright, so let's click OK, and as you can see, the file is completely blank. There are a couple of different workarounds, but if you're on a Mac, here's one that's relatively simple. If I right-click on the file and go to Open With, I can go down to Preview. And the file opens in Mac Preview. Essentially what it does is it converts the EPS to a PDF. And from here, if you click this little arrow, you will see where it's storing the file. And if you if you don't see it, like in this case I'm on the desktop and I actually don't see it, I'm gonna hit Shift Command S and make a copy and click and make sure I'm on the desktop. All right, I'm gonna close it and save the file. Let's close this and uh, here's the file that I just now created, the PDF. Let's go ahead and drag that down to Adobe Illustrator. BAM! Opens it up. Now, I do want to alert you to the fact that if you have a complex layer structure, it is probably gone. And also, if you select everything, it will show up as a clipping mask. So you'll have to go to Object, Clipping Mask, Release, and you may have to do it again. Object, Clipping Mask, Release. And I realize this isn't a perfect solution, but all of the paths are intact. And if you need to edit your file in vector format, you can go ahead and do that. So I'm going to click Save As. I'm on the desktop. I'm going to click Adobe Illustrator and Save. I already did this earlier, so I'm going to replace the file and click OK. Hey, you've been watching Design Ninja. If you found this video helpful, please click Like or subscribe to the channel below.